This was the scene outside the Empire Theatre Leicester Square on the night of the Royal Film Performance. Meanwhile, a galaxy of stars waited inside. Trevor Howard, his wife Helen Jerry, and Jack Hawkins. Petula Clark and Maurice Denham. Lugie Withers and her husband John McCallum have a word with Margaret Lockwood and Herbert Wilcox. Now Evelyn Keyes, Charlie Chaplin and his wife. And on the left, Herbert Lock. Veronica Hurst, Rock Hudson, Yvonne De Carlo and Terence Morgan. Celia Johnson with her small daughter Kate, ready to present a bouquet to the Queen, and with them Jack Warner. Sir Lawrence Olivier greets John Mills and Mrs Mills. Peggy Cummins, Kirk Douglas and Joan Greenwood. And here's Tamara Tumanova with Jean Kelly. Outside the theatre, the police had a strenuous job on hand as the huge crowd surged forward enthusiastically to see the arrival of the royal party. The Queen was accompanied to the performance by the Duke of Edinburgh and by Princess Margaret. Waiting to receive Her Majesty was Mr. Reginald Bromhead, Joint Chairman of the Cinematograph Trade Benevolent Fund, to which the proceeds of this performance were to be given. First, many film executives and leading personalities had the honour of presentation to Her Majesty and to the Duke. Then the film stars, the Queen with Ivan de Carlo, and Princess Margaret talks with Mr. and Mrs. Chapton. Morris Denham is now presented. Then Kirk Douglas and Douglas Fairbanks. Her Majesty stops to talk to Rock Hudson. And Celia Johnson makes her curtsy. Princess Margaret's bouquet was presented by young Caroline Pearl. When the presentations were over, the royal party went in to see the film Because You're Mine. There was also a stage performance by some 70 British and American stars. Certainly a memorable occasion, this the seventh royal film performance.